Hi guys, um, yesterday was my weigh-in, I think it's my fifth weigh-in, and it didn't go bad, but it didn't go as well as I wanted it to. I lost um, 1.8 pounds in that week, so it's better than gaining it, and it's better than staying the same, right? And it's better than 0.2 pounds, so... Uh, this week, I I don't even, honestly, I don't know what I, what, what I did wrong. Actually, this week, I actually went to the gym. And I went twice. And it was like moderate exercise, but I went, you know? So, I don't know. But um, I ate the same things. I followed the whole point system thing. I wonder why I didn't lose 3.4 pounds or 3 pounds. Anyway, um, I want to lose 4 more pounds. Uh, you know, soon. That means I lost 20 pounds. Um, I think when I lose 25 pounds, I'm going to start putting my face, my, uh, my videos up on Facebook. I don't know if I wanted to share this journey just yet with my personal friends and family until I'm like 100% sure that this is going good. So when I reach my 25 pound mark, yeah, hopefully I don't change my mind to, um, 30 pounds then I probably will put this up on Facebook for now. Um, it's really it. I mean, I ate the right things. I was, actually, I was actually eating a lot of vegetables. And um, I ate my protein and everything. And... I don't know. Could it, I'm, I'm trying to think, you know, could stress be the target of this, you know, I don't know. I, I don't think it's a bad thing. I just, you know, of course I wanted to lose more, but you don't always get what you want, right? And I look like crap, I know, because it's been a very tough week for me. I've been testing and it's pretty crazy. It was a writing test. And I haven't wrote for a really long time, so it was really irritating. And um, my son drove me crazy this week, so that's probably why too. And that's really about it. So hopefully next week I'll do better. Because, I mean, here's the thing, right? I actually Googled it. That slow weight loss is the best weight loss. Because um, when you do a diet... It's, it's, well, well, for one reason, when you do a diet, it's more like a temporary thing. I've done a diet when I was in Egypt and I lost weight, but it was like a temporary thing and it, it came back on. Could be because I had a baby, so I was overeating maybe during my pregnancy. And it could be just because you, in your mind, you know that this is a temporary thing. Okay, five months, I lost the weight that I wanted. Okay, now I can start eating, you know? But the thing about Weight Watchers, what I like about this diet, I mean, while, I mean, yes, I am losing the weight kind of slow, but I am, um, I'm picking up on really, really, really good habits that I never, ever, um, that I never, ever really did before. Sorry, I just realized that my colors were McDonald's colors, and I'm really irritated about that now. Can you still see it? How about now? How about now? Whatever. Anyway, so, um, so, what was I saying? I forgot. Um, oh, so, I'm picking up on really good habits, like eating vegetables now. Um, a lot of vegetables. I eat broccoli all the time, mushrooms. I actually picked that up from one of my friends. Hey, again, I love you. She used to dip mushrooms in mustard. And since I, since then, I just cut up my mushrooms, um, raw, and I just, Dip in mushroom and then uh, in mustard, so and then you you learn to um you know steer clear of those crazy foods like you know um I think I talked about this last week but tuna would you know you would think tuna is a good thing and it's and with all the mayonnaise in it and stuff it was really bad so you learn how to so that kind of taught me that you know what okay it could seem like a good thing but people but these companies to make it taste better more appealing to you so you could buy it more they'll put in you know ingredients that'll make it taste good but it's not necessarily good for your health 
so definitely looking at the ingredients was a big thing for me uh, not the ingredients i'm sorry the nutrition the nutritional label and um and um yeah so like, like i was saying you know i picked up on a lot of actually i went to a meeting yesterday and they were talking about vitamins how you should take a vitamin you know your vitamins every day whatever and i never used to do that and i actually stopped by gnc today and i started looking at the multivitamins so I might actually start taking that. So this is something that I would have probably not done with, you know, with the regular diet. So, or like a temporary, temporary diet or whatever. Um, um, a thing about diets or, you know, weight loss in general, I would think that you need to, you know, surround yourself with supportive people because I had a situation, um, where, you know, you're losing weight, you're happy. When I call my mother up, she's super excited for me, and she's happy. And when I told her, you know, I lost a little bit, she a little bit of weight, even she's excited and she's happy, and you know, she's just souped up for me, basically. She's really excited for me, and she keeps telling me to, to keep on going. Her and my father, but somebody like I won't mention any names, like my mother-in-law's name, but um, but um, every time I try to tell her I lost it, she goes, mm. okay, so what's mm. Well, that means she uh, she's not satisfied. Not that I care, but you should. I mean, if, if she had told me, like, okay, it's okay or whatever, you keep, you know, um, I probably would have been a little bit more happier. It didn't really affect too much on me, but it did, you know, upset me a little bit that, you know, she could have been more supportive. And um, she, she went on a diet, her and my, my, some, my her my husband's brother's wife and they lost weight and within um I think a month they gained double that weight back so yeah anyway so, so definitely surround yourself with supportive people people who think positive and that's about it I can't believe this video is seven uh, minutes already it's because I didn't have my ideas organized not that I ever do but I think it's the McDonald's color. I'm very irritated now. I didn't take I didn't notice this. If I noticed this, I wouldn't have worn these colors. Bye.